for Channel Green for All. I'm Nikki Henderson. And I'm Julian Mosey McQueen. We're out here in front of our nation's capital. This year, 2009, our moment. Right now, we have an opportunity. We have to seize this opportunity. Because what I think that this is about is about not doing work for people, but doing work with people. So if you, not with a bougie revolution, and you really about creating some change and making these policy makers from Barack Obama on down recognize the power we have and make some noise. In the snowstorm, in the blizzard, we are here because we care about the green economy. And it's not just us. We're out here today with seven thousands of our brothers and sisters and friends and family from all across the country. What brings you out here, man? Man, it's pretty much my family, you know. It's it's uh, it's my hood back in, back in the city. They need jobs. They're struggling, and you know this green job movement. They got to know that it's not just a hippie movement, man. I wanna shift the power in Africa and support these amazing young people in America and tell them that the action they are doing having an impact, a direct impact in Africa and that we, we believe that we will, we will win this fight. This is just the most beautiful thing I think I've seen in a long time. As one of the leaders of this movement, what do you want to see at the next power shift? I hope when we come back a year from now, there will be tens of thousands more of us. We'll be from urban communities and rural communities. We'll be, we'll be the ones putting in the solar panels. We'll be the ones starting the solar panel companies. That's what I hope to see in 2009. We're here at Congress to talk to our congressional representatives about green jobs, about the need for an inclusive green economy, about the need to address climate change now and address it in a big and bold way. And it puzzles me because New Mexico is number two. That's correct, number two in the entire nation for solar potential and number 12 for wind potential. We are literally having opportunities shining down upon us, yet for some reason we're letting them blow right past us. We deserve the opportunity to take advantage of our state's huge potential. And the thing I cannot understand is why so many indigenous peoples are dying every day due to unsustainable mining, extraction, refinement, and storage processes when there is a wealth of renewable energy potential on our indigenous lands. And we're not going to leave until we get the answers we want. President Kennedy started the Peace Corps. President Clinton called citizens to serve through America. Now is the time for the next generation to be part of the Clean Energy Corps. To build a new energy backbone. And so there's no snowstorm or no cold weather that's going to stop us. That's going to stop you. us, baby. Yeah. Can't stop, won't stop. Ain't no stopping us now. We're really happy to be here. We thank you so much for joining us. And you watching Green For All TV. And remember, this is protected by the red, the black, black and, and the green. green. <laughs> <laughs>